everyone so in this video i'll be discussing lines and planes which is 12.5 part of your syllabus so suppose we have two vectors a and b and there are three elements in both so it is for three dimensional now in the previous video i have already discussed if this vector is a and this is b then b minus a would be this because a plus b minus a would fetch you the b vector so a plus b minus a would give us the b vector now if i add a plus t times b minus a then this vector will keep on moving forward if t is greater than 1 if t is greater than 1 to ye wala sara portion cover hoga if t is equals to 1 to exactly b minus a yahan pe pahunch jayenge and if t is less than 1 and lies between 0 and 1 to idhar kahi pahunch payenge hum and if t is less than 0 to ye vector ye ye puri line cover ho jayegi to basically agar a vector mein hum t times b minus a kare to we can get a line ye ek line aa jati hai that will depend on the value of t ठीक है यहाँ तक समझ आया इसको अब हम थोड़ा फॉर्मली लिखते हैं अ लाइन इन आर एन द लाइन एल थ्रू ए सो दिस वाज द लाइन एल थ्रू ए थ्रू ए बिकॉज एट दिस पॉइंट वी आर हैविंग ए ए वेर इट इज द एन डायमेंशनल वेक्टर एंड बी इज द सेट ऑफ ऑल एक्स इज द सेट ऑफ ऑल एक्स सेटिस्फाइंग एक्स इक्वल्स टू so x equals to 1 okay how how do we get this now you can look at this equation this was x and as you keep on changing the value of t the x value would change so you can cover all these line now this is a plus tb minus ta so this can be written as a common 1 minus t plus tb so x can be written as this so as the value of t changes we would have a different vector so it would be like this then this then this and it would be the here as well so the line l through a and b is the set of all x equals to this this is also n dimension satisfying x equals to 1 minus t a plus t b and how did we get this with the help of this thing right for some real number t okay now let's do an example usse thoda aur clarity aayegi describe the straight line in r3 through the two points so first point is 1 2 2 and the second point b is minus 1 minus 1 4 this is a the vector a this is vector b where does it meet the x1, x2 plane? Okay, so starting with, describe the straight line. So, starting with the equation of the straight line, we know, as you have already discussed, that x equals to 1 minus t a plus t b would give you the equation of the line. So, since there are three components in this element, so in x, there would be three components, namely, x1 x2 and x3 so x1 would be 1 minus t into a into a so the first component of a is 1 into 1 because we are considering for x1 and then tb t the first component minus 1 so if you solve this 1 minus t minus t this is 1 minus 2t now for x2 x2 would be 1 minus t into a2 and a2 is 2 so into 2 plus t into minus 1 so this comes out to be 1 minus 2t minus t so, so this is 2 minus 2t so this is 2 minus 3t and now for x3 it is 1 minus t into 2 plus 4 into t so this is 2 minus 2t plus 4t 
which is 2 plus 2t. Okay, so we are getting this. Now, where does it meet the x1, x2 plane? So, it would meet the x1, x2 plane when x3 is 0. Three dimensional mein, this is two dimensional mein hum karte hai. Wo x axis pe koi bhi line tab intersect karte hai. Jab y zero hota hai. To x y plane pe agar wo intersect kar rahe hai. To that means the third component z is zero. Jaise is case mein x one, x two, x three hai. To x one, x two plane mein tab intersect karega when x three is zero. To x three zero, this was x three. So this would mean two plus two t equals to zero. We'll just add some space here. Okay. So 2 minus 2t is 0. This implies t equals to minus 1. Now if t equals to minus 1, x1 would be 1 minus 2t, which is 1 minus minus 2, which is 3. And x2 would be this thing, 2 minus 3 into minus 1, which is 2 plus 3, which is 5. So when we are at the coordinate 3, 5 and 0. It would intersect the x1, x2 axis. Okay, I hope this was clear. Now, moving forward. Suppose P equals to P1, P2, Pn, N elements is a point in Rn. The straight line L passing through P1, P2, Pn in the same direction as the vector A. So, this was the initial vector. The initial point this P and the straight line passing through this point in the same direction as the vector A. So if it is suppose this is vector A, if this is moving in this direction, then the equation of the line is given by x equals to P plus T. Now if T equals to 1. Suppose, suppose t equals to 0, we have x equals to, this implies x equals to p. And if t equals to 1, this implies x equals to p plus a. So if t is 0, we are at this point. If t is 1, so t, p plus a till here. So we'll reach point b. And now if t is suppose 2, so this would be twice the area of a, this plus this. So we would eventually end up at c. So similarly, if t is less than 0, suppose if t is minus 1, will be minus 1 times the distance of a from here. Suppose this is coming at point d. So if we have a point and then we can find the line which is going in the same direction as the vector a, right? So we can use this as well if we know the direction and the point or on the other hand we have discussed about this as well. Okay now moving on just the last question find the equation for the line that passes through points 3 minus 2 2 and 10 to 1. So these are two points. So we know x equals to 1 minus t times a plus t times b. So in this case, x would become, x1 would be 1 minus t times 3 plus t times 10. So this is nothing but 3 minus 3t plus 10t, which is 3 plus 7t. x2 would be minus uh, 1 minus t into minus 2 plus 2 times t. So this is minus 2 plus 2t two plus 2t. Two so this becomes minus 2 plus 4t. Whereas if you are considering about x3, so this becomes 1 minus t times 2 plus 1 times t. So this is 2 minus 2t two plus t. So this is 2 minus t. Now in this question, it was given, two points were given to us. Whereas suppose if it is given that one point is 
वन पॉइंट इज वन थ्री टू एंड हैज द सेम डायरेक्शन सो दीज आर द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द बुक इट सेल्फ आई सॉल्व पास्ट इज एज वेल वंस वी आर डन विद द कोर्स डायरेक्शन एज जीरो माइनस वन वन नाउ इन दिस केस वील यूज दिस फॉर्मूला बिकॉज वन पॉइंट इज गिवन टू अस एंड द डायरेक्शन सो एक्स इक्वल्स टू पी प्लस टी ए द इक्वेशन वुड बी एक्स इक्वल्स टू पी प्लस टी ए वेयर ए इज द सेम डायरेक्शन रेक्टर एंड द पॉइंट इज पी सो दिस वुड बिकम एक्स इक्वल्स टू एक्स वन इक्वल्स टू पी इज दिस दिस इज ए सो एक्स वन इक्वल्स टू वन प्लस टी टाइम्स जीरो सो एक्स वन इक्वल्स टू वन एक्स टू इक्वल्स टू थ्री प्लस टी टाइम्स माइनस वन विच बिकम्स थ्री माइनस टी एंड एक्स थ्री इक्वल्स टू टू प्लस टी टाइम इंटू वन विच बिकम्स टू प्लस टी सो वी हैव द इक्वेशन फॉर द लाइन ओके थैंक यू and i uh, i'll be doing hyperplanes in the next class and then we'll move on to matrices okay thank you